to the show Power for You. Um, I'm Linda McDowell and just glad you're here. You know, I've done a couple of YouTube videos and I'm working to get them better and better. And as I do this, sometimes I bump you along the way. Um, but what the show is about is the mature woman's or my generation of women who are in their 50 plus years and how we can still walk up. Because as a 50 plus woman or more mature woman, I'm also a woman and I have advice that I live the full life that I can give some advice to younger women on, you know, how to choose a mate, to do that carefully, prayerfully and powerfully, to choose somebody that compliments you and not to just settle for any old thing. You know, and those are some of the discussions that I hope to pursue and to have. I'll have a segment called Baby Girl Pearl, where it's just like pearls of wisdom that I'm giving to younger women. And just as I'm saying that, one of the baby girl pearls that I like to give to younger women is invest in you. Because when you invest in yourself, in your, in your learning, in your spiritual life, personal life, in your business life, when you've invested well in yourself, then you 
are something fears that when a man comes to you, mother, teacher, lover, and all we play these different, different roles, but bring all of you to the table powerfully because you've been vested in being the best that you are. And then I like to say, it is nothing wrong with accentuating and, you know, making this outside appearance, wearing makeup and having nice clothes. Those are all beautiful things. I love them. I love to do those things too. And we'll have some of that on the show too. But I also want to make sure that we are invested on the inside of us also. So all of that being said, you know, one of the things I want to say that as you are 50 plus, I'm a mother and a grandmother, that I don't have to, you know, I hate to say it,
a force to be reckoned with and we want nice clothing too. And you know what, I shop at all kinds of places. Um, like Brian, you know, all the other places that young women shop. And I just have to be careful to make sure that the clothes that I get are clothes that are fitting and, um, you know, are attractive and they portray who I want to portray and who I am. You have to find pieces and put them all together. Sometimes I shop my own clothes and if I don't put yours, I would have quite a few clothes. I wouldn't expect to have a vision for this show, but I do that. And sometimes I think it's fun for us to shop our own clothes and pick up things with accessories and scarves and all of that kind of thing to make even shopping our own clothes economical. The other part of that is I don't want to break the bank one clothes. Poised, polished, and professional, and that's what I have to do after everyday life. When it looks poised, I want to look poised, polished, and professional. So today, I've shot my own closet to find things that work for me and to find new ways to do it. So I'm gonna stand up so that you can see. I got this skirt from Lane Bryant. I'm gonna go back here and get out of my chair. I don't know if you can see it, but the top everything I got a long time ago. I don't even remember where I got it. And I just kind of mixed it. And I'm going to turn this up another way so that you can get the full, full view. Sorry about this. 